This is Forex analysis for September week four, looking at what happened. And so we can look at a projection for first week of October. So what we are looking at is the weekly time frame. As you can see, since October, July, price been in a, in a consolidation. It's moving sideways or horizontally. That's what price been doing. As you can see, between this resistance and this support right here. So price been doing this. Down come down to it again, go up to that uh, resistance, come to that support. And then as you can see, price is moving between these two, between these two uh, uh, support and resistance. So it's a way to take trade. Can price do this? Come back to test that four hour here and continue to go to the zone that we are looking for? Yes. Price might do this, come back to it again before come back to break it. Or like we said, price might just break it and continue to go higher from here. That's a possibility. Or price, I just respected it to go down lower. This is what we see in the daily time frame. But you see price last week, stay here, stay here, touch it last time and then price close higher. Most likely when, price, when, when the market is open, price, price might, might, might come back to open here, to go up here, this way, to either do this, come test here, to do that, and then come back to that support here, before to come back here again, either to break it or to come to stop here to go down. Let's go to the four hour time frame to see if we can see what we see. So there you can see in the four hour time frame, last time price has been consolidating. My price was going from, from that daily resistance right here, price has been going down. Wow, look at that. So. This is four hour. You can see price has been consolidating in here in the four hour time frame. You see, price was coming down, bearish, come touch it, go down, create a support here, go up. When it's come back here in the four hour time frame, what do you think? Do you think it's a possibility to get in? Of course, it's a possibility to get in. Hey, <laughs> it's created one here and it's come back to it. Most likely it will respect it to do this. A double bottom to come back here. You can see price was tested here. Before break it, price is gonna come down to that daily support here. That's what price been doing. Touch it to go higher. See, it's touch it over here. Touch it again here, and then price come down to that daily before it come to break it again in the four hour time frame. Most likely, price might do this, and then come back to test this. Right? This is a shorter thing, right? Four hour time frame we are looking at right now. This is why we pay attention to the to the multiple time frame analysis because this telling us a lot about the market in the short term. You can see where we can put a short trade here. Come back to test this four hour resistance. It give us a bearish engulfing to go lower. When it get here, price gonna stop here because you see what you see, you see that, that, that weekly, I mean daily support here. And also we have a four hour support right here again in the middle of it to go higher up here and to come down right here. If we go to the one hour time frame, we might find consolidation right here. You see this? This is what I'm talking about, right? So price is consolidating 
between uh, these in the in the shorter time frame. But when price get here, that was it's consolidating between there and here. This is these four, and then price break it. You see, so if you are here, you said, ah, price is coming here. Um, I'm just gonna sell it again because it rejected here. Always put stop loss because if price goes against you, you have a way to get a short. You you can you can do a short loss, and then when price come back at some point, if price gonna continue to go up, what do you think gonna happen over here? Over here, price will test that. So whatever you lost here, when price come back to test it, either if you enter here. You have your stop loss above here. If price get here, don't take you out. Price will come back here. When it's come back here, what do you do? You get out of the sell and you 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 get into the buy to go higher on the uh with with it. So this is why we do what we do. And this is the four-hour time frame. One hour time frame tells us the same thing as we saw. And then now we can see, hey. Technical analysis works. Okay. It's good to know about fundamental analysis, but as a trader, once you understand technical analysis, your trading will be going to the next level. And when you learn confirmation, when you learn how to draw support and resistance, man, that might change your life. So if you want to do learn how to do this, if you don't know how to do that, if you want to learn, go check out www.eta25pips.com. I went to that school. I think it's one of the best and they might be able to help you become a consistent trader. See you next time.